Well, we've always wanted to have an auction. We got to meet the, the folks from the finest, and we said, well, we'd be glad to have you here. And it seemed to be a great marriage. And boy, what you see here tonight, that tells you them. I mean, they put on one of the finest shows you could ever want to see. The Elegance is a very exclusive concours. And it's only 75 cars, it's by invitation only. And the organizers of the Elegance try to be very careful in their curation of the cars that are to be displayed. And they cover a rather broad range, years, exclusivity, uh, many of them are one of one, hand-built cars, and a lot of them are cars that you wouldn't see at another Concours. So we tried to be sensitive to that and curate our collection of cars to sort of evoke the feel of the Concours itself. I was walking in, I heard somebody in front of me said if I would have known it was going to be this first class, I would have consigned a few cars. And these people are often at auctions, or almost all those people that show are buying at auctions, so it gives them the opportunity to do so. If you go down to Harrisburg Airport and see the number of private jets sitting there, and you'll know that there's a lot of important collectors here. They've all given me very positive vibes about what they see here and about their interest in the event. It's incredible. I think it surpassed our expectations. It is stunning. I think everyone's going to be very, very happy with what they see. There's a bit of something for everyone here with a focus on quality and uniqueness. When we first came to Hershey, Pennsylvania, we saw an employee parking lot. Thankfully, we were able to transform it. We've accommodated this tent to have clear panels, so it's, it's more of a feeling of what the car would look like outside. It has a median that goes down the center of it, so we have trees in our tent. So it really kind of gives a real nice feeling. Uh, we have the side panels open on the tent. It's surrounded by beautiful pine trees, very close to the golf course, right next to the hotel. This is sort of like a garden party. Hershey started six years ago. It was founded by my father-in-law, Jack Rich. He was a big collector of cars. It's important that people know that the Elegance at Hershey is here to raise funds for type 1 diabetes and the AACA. That, you know, my main goal is to find a cure for my son and anyone who's living with type 1 diabetes. We've raised almost a million dollars for the cause and 10,000 people we expect through here over the weekend. Here we are today at jam-packed weekend of everything is sold out. We wanted to have multiple things going on and the Hershey Hill Climb goes back 50 years and there's been some of the most of the famous racers raced on the hill over the years. We've put together a group and we've uh, raced ever since the year or day one. So you have a competition event and you have a show event and what was kind of missing is an auction. When someone walks through the, the door, it's about feeling the brand experience immediately. It's got to punch you right in the heart. And I think that the passion comes from the heart, the cars come from the heart, and uh, you know, the presentation really comes from the heart. All of the owners are quite pleased with how we are displaying their cars, how they are being taken care of and attended to. We've gotten quite a lot of really, really good feedback. We have many car specialists here to tell you about the cars, so that if you're coming uh, either tonight or tomorrow to bid, that you'll be able to see those specialists and they'll be able to give you any of the particulars about the car. Putting the cars first, that's really what it comes down to. So. No matter if you're in a building, a hotel, or you build a tent, you need to work with what you're working with in a way that you can present the cars with 15 feet of space away from one another. So you can have a whole family come in and walk around the car, you know, at the same time. They don't have to feel like they're going to scratch anything or rub up against anything. And so the focus becomes really about the car itself. We're kind of honored and, and very excited to be a part of what is becoming one of the premier Concours events, you know, not only in the country, but in the world. Lot number 127 is a 1927 Bugatti Type 38A, uh, part of the collection from our founder, Mr. Jack Rich. 350 on bid, 360, brand new bid in the middle of the room, 380,000, 385. You can say 400 at any time you like. Oh, that'll do. That's <laughs> in front of me to the man with ice in his veins at $400,000. Thank you very much indeed. I'm very happy with the outcome. I think we had some really great cars, and I think it was a good sale.